Hey guys, it's the 25th of June, 2024. It's 81 degrees out, but there's a breeze. Um, look at this. Would you look at that? Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> I'm gonna do a rosy. That's a Cadillac of mowers right there. <laughs> yeah, baby. That's the Cadillac of mowers. I'm so happy to have it. I've never had a brand new mower before. Well, I've never had to mow, really, because, you know, I was married. My brothers mowed when I was little. Dad wouldn't let us mow. He was like, that's man's work. And then my husband mowed, so I didn't have to mow until I got divorced and lived in a house. And you don't have to mow when you're in an apartment. But yeah. That's a Cadillac of mowers, baby. <laughs> I'm so happy. Uh, my daughter-in-law, Angie, gave it to me. It was Charlie's mower. And uh, they're getting a new one. They're getting their riding mower fixed. Her mom's going to fix her riding mower for her. So she gave it to me. When, he, when he, Someone gave it to him when he first got it. I went out there and I saw it. And uh, son-in-law, Andy, was mowing with it. And, I was like, I, it was Leonidas's, must have been his 16th birthday, 17th, 16th. I always track of how old them kids are, jeez Louise, 16th. Anyways, uh, I was like, I have more envy, Charlie, I have more envy. <laughs> it's, it has, I'm going to have to learn everything it has. It has a, yeah, up is locked, okay. It has a a mulcher on it, uh, a bag, of course the easy start, it starts the first time, and it's a Honda, and let's see what else does it have, of course it has the self-propelled, or I wouldn't be able to mow this huge yard, I only mowed the side, I'll show you what it looks like in a minute, I love how it makes your yard look too, it's so pretty, because of the mulching feature, but anyways, uh, I'm not mowing. See where it's all burnt? I didn't mow all last week. A lot of people didn't because it was just a heat wave and it burned our yard so you couldn't mow or it would have made it worse. But the side was where all the rain and shade is. It was getting tall so I got it mowed. Back in there where the lilac bushes are and then I mowed the front. But anyways, look, it has the blade control, of course. Well, I used to like pull this back and strap it with a on them plastic handcuffs. <laughs> um, I don't do that anymore because I'm older. And my balance is pretty good for an old lady, but you never know. And I won't be able to let go of it if I fall. Anyways, it has this uh, control speed adjust for the self-propel. Never had one like that either. So yeah, I'm so happy. I'm so happy and most so nice. And it, when I first got it, it was kind of dirty. They probably had it in the barn, maybe, or the garage. I don't know. But it was just dusty. It wasn't filthy. It was just dusty. So I wanted to test it out. I didn't even clean it. So I have a clip of when I'm mowing. Hopefully you can hear me talking over the mower. But, uh, yeah, I got it all cleaned off now. I'll keep it that way. Keep it nice. Charlie's memory. My my shed needs a new floor. Mom got this shed when she, after she moved in with Grandma. It needs a new floor in it. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys the, my new mower. I'm so happy. <laughs> happy, happy, joy, joy. And I'll show you what good job it does. Makes your yard look pretty. It's supposed to rain here soon. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. But look how pretty. Look how pretty that mulching feature does. Isn't it beautiful? I couldn't fit three of them in there. And Jesse's stepdad gave me two mowers. And that one I could never get running. But the other one that I've been using, it's self-propelled. And it's nice, so I'm keeping it for a spare. Anything should happen. Um... 
I need the weed eater. I weed eat by hand, guys. I don't have a weed eater. But those flowers get ready to bloom. Planted the lily out right here. Thought that'd be a good place for it. Tiger lilies bloom. See how come nice that looks. Isn't it pretty? No more tiger lilies to get rain and bloom. There's another one. We've had so much rain lately. And then we had uh we had monsoons and well it happens every year. And then we had the uh heat advisory for a week, which was awful. Finally got the sidewalk cleaned off. So yeah, there, needless to say, there's no gym day today. I went there yesterday, I put a clip up. There's no gym day today because this is my workout. But yeah, you have to, well, in my case, I sweep, I shovel it, I uh, put it in a bucket because I don't own a wheelbarrow. And then I put it back up there against that, where they didn't bring the pavement down. Yeah, I know. Like I said, I've been saying since I moved in, I need a. I've been here a year now. I need a French drain. I just have to rent the equipment myself and do it myself. Cause I understand, you know, kids work. They don't have time. But yeah, that sidewalk, the water just runs down. You can see the rocks on the road. It was all piled up with rocks, and a lot of them run down. And that's where they're at right there. They need put back in the driveway, but. No sense in doing it. I mowed this well, the uh, day after Jed dropped the mower off <laughs> to try it out out front because it was getting really high. So I mowed it. Uh, when did he drop it off? Saturday. No, Friday. He dropped it off Friday because he had to go to the clubhouse Friday night and take uh, Charlie's cut down there. And they put it in a frame and they put it up on the wall of the clubhouse. So. He had a rough night Friday night, and the, but we had a celebration too, and we're gonna have we're gonna have another celebration of life. We're gonna uh, well, it's Skinner's birthday every year. He shoots off fireworks, and we can celebrate Charlie too, and sit around and tell Charlie stories. But yeah, that's what the front looks like. I just love this mall. I love it. Love it. Love it. Thank you, Charlie. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna do me well, as long as I take care of it. But yeah, right here gets a lot of shade from the... Uh, and this isn't bamboo that hardens. It's a family of bamboo plants, but it doesn't get hard like sticks that you can make fishing pole, bamboo fishing poles out of. It holds a bunch of water. It's like a water type bamboo. It never gets hard. Anyways, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. Rosa Sharon's starting to bloom. I was over at my friend Andrew's house yesterday. His Rosa Sharon was, well, his great grandma's was blooming. Well, it's his now, cause he inherited her house. He lived there and took care of her. He lived there since he was five years old and she raised him. His great grandma. So, anyways, uh, yeah. And then him and Ray are selling the house they're living in now. Or no, selling it. They're renting it. They're gonna rent it. They're be gonna become landlords. I know they won't be slumlords because <laughs> their house is neat as a pen. But yeah, look how dry the yard got in places, guys. It's awful. It'll come back. It always does. <laughs> I just love my new Honda. Let's see if I can get a booklet for it and read up on it or just go on the interwebs. I pretty much had it figured out. I I tore the filter case, air filter, air cleaner thing off already and put it back on. I gotta be careful, careful, careful. Good thing I didn't rip the filter. I know a little bit about them, enough to make them work, but it'd be nice if I had a book to it. But it'd end up like every other book, tucked in a drawer somewhere, <laughs> never to be brought out again. 
All right, guys, I'm going to get off here. I hope everyone's having a, a terrific Tuesday. Didn't have Rai Rai last night. Uh, either Jeb was off or she stayed with Landon. I know Landon was off because he's off today. He only works Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So maybe she's old enough. I mean, he's old enough to watch her. He'll be 17 in August. Him and Leonidas. Oh, and Leonidas changed the oil in his dad's garage. Charlie would be so proud of him. Yeah, he changed a friend's oil. I guess he'll he'll take over the garage. He uh, helped Charlie on some of the cars he had to work on. So yeah, Leonidas is going to be the carry on the family tradition of being a mechanic. So that made me happy. <laughs> yeah, I told him I was proud of him. Yeah, look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Just look at it. Uh, all right guys i'm gonna get off of here i love you and uh like i said i hope everybody had a wonderful uh wonderful um hope everybody wants to have a marvelous monday Jeez, louise charlotte learn how to talk all right i love you guys take care bye for now